Alright, hello again. We are back with another commentary on my multiboxing experience in Scarlet Monastery. If I don't fuck up again, <laughs> we should get a pretty good run going here. Silence her. Pull these as well. And spam your flash heal. Please don't die. Okay, we got two stuns now. Ah, there's the pet. actually a little bit scary right now. Everything worked out pretty good. Get them back here into single target DPS on the, her. Looks good. Everything's under control. And with the level advantage now I don't have so much trouble. Everything's getting resisted. Some shit. In the glimpse of my eye I saw the other pet right now. I'm going back a little. Just doing some evocation. Off. Get the shield going. Pull him with the other three. A uh, good thing is he goes melee. Uh, he just shoots once and then goes melee. Even though he uses a bow in the first shot. That works pretty well. I just spam prayer of healing right now. Get another shield on the first one and then flash heal. And it makes quick work of them. Alright, light cape of the owl. Five in, five spirit. Or is this stam? No, it's in. Owl is in spirit. Let's see what my. Uh, is he has. Three and four spirit. That's good. Let's give it to my healer then. Equip it real quick. With the advantage. Alright. I just keep those boys here. Then we pull with my one main mage. Got pretty well. It didn't break. Spam heal on him, spam heal on the last one. And these are only three, so they didn't give much trouble. Perfect. And full again. I think I should skill in uh, Prayer of Healing. I think it does 20 It's 20% 20 less mana used per Prayer of Healing. I kind of don't know what I should do with the Priest. I have to think about that a little more, or, or uh, try some different specs or look in some forums. I don't know. We will see how much so much so close. Holy shit! All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I try to keep it around twenty minutes per run. I think it works out pretty well. And the pull in the uh, in the long haul, I try my flame strike macro. I did a macro with uh, four flame strike, which sets the cameras on all characters instantly, like this. Everyone looks in the same direction, and then I just click uh, in the, on the feet of the characters, so they just use presence of mind, and then flame strike instantly after that, and that should work pretty well. I will see you soon. Silence. That's a Galand. That's another Galand. And another one. Well, wow, perfect. I think our times are pretty good right now. Let's try not to fuck up any pulls. And we should be fine. A lot of XP. Good timings. I actually didn't get a single uh, random drop all the time I farmed here. That's been a lot of hours right now. I can't use that yet. Don't think I got anything noteworthy this dungeon. 
but that's more luck in future dungeons, so I'm okay with this. Try to position ourselves good in the first place for a single target DPS after we kill the hounds. To our last one. Perfect, and a level up. Let's get another heal and then just two fire blasts and arcane missiles should do the job here. Holy shit. Perfect. Very rough healing. And I'm another whistle, another whistle. So we, I think we have four whistles now. <laughs> and I, uh, I want to try to get a. I get it. I want to try to use the four whistles or five whistles on all chars at the same time with the end boss. He has one. Ah, uh, he has no whistle. Let this for him. Perfect. So we have three, right? Four, three or four right now. It just drops all the time. Like in the first 10 or 15 runs, nothing dropped at all, and that just drops all the time. It's very weird. Sometimes you just have luck, I guess. So I just need one. Two, three, four. Yeah, one more whistle and we're good. I can try this. That'd be pretty funny. But I think the dog is. What's the dog? 25? Oh, it's 30 actually. Nice. Oh, come on, guys. Dog is level 30. Nice. That's cool. Five dogs. Wonder what he does on damage. Let's see. She, hit, she hits me. He should. Oh, okay. Pulls aggro. 13, 13, miss. He has no HP, bro. Look at this. He, just get, he gets fucked up. That's <laughs> whistless. Not very good. Okay, let's pull the whole room. Oh god, I think my healer just got stunned. So no, 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 no pull room. No pull. That was a pretty good stun. Not a stun, but not on the healer, so everything's fine. Okay. All good. Sometimes the mob just do exactly what they shouldn't do. This particular moment. I'm saying, does the pet actually want her right there where she is? That should be enough. Oh shit, spam flash heal, spam flash heal. He gets a lot of damage now. And a shield on the first one, and a prayer of healing. And that should be enough. I just bumped him down. Nothing to see here. I'm still at like. 35 or 40k. I forgot to reset actually for this run. Uh, 30k XP an hour. But I forgot to reset Titan Bar. It says 40 now. Uh, 30 now. I think it's like 40. Or let's say 35 to 40k XP an hour. When you get the gist of the dungeon, it's really, really fast. It's just the first like 5 or 6 or 7 tries. We fuck up majorly, you fuck up a little bit. And now I think we are pretty okay. I actually didn't think it would be so much fun to multibox. It's still a lot of fun. It has its learning experience though, I won't lie. Okay, that's enough for now. I don't want to die. Sometimes they hit really stupid like they all hit the same uh, character at the same time and everyone crits and it's just over and i want to do that right now sometimes big pulls are fun but most of the time i fuck them up and die still <laughs> fuck up in time <laughs> I always try to uh, let the weakened soul fade a little bit, so I can instantly uh, shield again. There's one mage in there, two monks, then these. Let's pull these four and just uh, flame strike them real quick here. There. Let's see what I think. Mm, I'm 
second. Maybe no flame strike now. Okay. They just cast two spells, so it's shadow and fire. Sometimes they just they run to, through you, but sometimes they just instantly cast the other school of magic and your silence doesn't work. That's the, that was this case. Just do whatever they want. Let's get a quick prayer of healing. Everyone's topped off. Drink. Uh, let's get full mana. Oh, there's only two. Ah, well. Better than nothing. Get another prayer of healing, top everyone off. We're good. Oh, nine intellect, nine stem. But I have Aragol robes. I don't think they're better. But nine int, nine stem. Nine int. 5 stem, 3 edgy, 10 spirit. Nah, I don't think that's good. That's a lot of fun, this little uh, game or uh, small game where you just equip all your characters at the same time and try to balance it out a little bit so uh, one ha doesn't have like 4k mana and the other one has like 2k mana. Multiboxing in general is just really fun. Let's swim more. Yeah, that should be good. Come, 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 guys. Hello. <laughs> just chill for a second. Perfect. Couldn't go better than this one. We just uh, we just have more uh, XP per hour than we had before, so it's still rising. I think 40k is is a, is a good um, good indicator, but you have to play really fast, really good. And now with level uh, 45, where some mobs are already under me, it's really easy. When you come here with, I, ca I came here with level 42, 31. Wasn't that fun. Bye. Wasn't that funny. That's mainly because the mobs are orange. When the mobs are orange, they resist a lot. And you just do very strange damage. Numbers sometimes. Come on! Oh, nice. Okay, that crit. <laughs> you know, you need the luck sometimes, man. It's all a numbers game here. <laughs> oh, Elder's Head of the Eagle. This is really good, I think. That sounds pretty good. Elder Head of the Eagle. Nine int, nine stam. God damn. This is like the best helm you can get at this level, I think. He has no helm. He has no helm, so I guess I give it him. To him. Nice, that's cool. And all of my farming here, I just found a single uh, necklace. I think it's a Mauda video where it drops. It's for Ag Agi 4 int. It's 22 gold, so you can't imagine how rare this thing is this level range this one's really quick whoop it's locked, oh, it's locked.
But other than that, I'm still trying to do... I don't have any new, extremely new macros. I just try to um, do my normal rotation well. Make better pulls, be faster. Come on, stand up. Get arcane missiles going. Works pretty well. Oh god, okay. <laughs> That was like perfect in between his cars. How bad. <laughs> but it's okay. It's a learning experience here. We had just to write a friend. Was a little bit distracted. Another chaplain. Let's do some solo pulls, which I shouldn't be doing. But we do them anyway. That's one, two. And arcane missiles after that. Okay, that should kill them anyway. Perfect. Get healing through. And I think it's time for another evocation. I really need to try to use evocation more. It's so fast, so good. Such a perfect talent for this multi boxing thing. Just stun this one, pull these two back. I don't need to. Make another silence right now. Some focus healing and another uh, prayer of healing and everything's fine. Nice. I think I'm still on the... 25 minutes, right? We'll see. I just try to be fancy and do a big pull right now. Okay, the damage is spread between multiple uh, mages, which is always good. You don't want to hit them. We don't want them to hit just one target. I could have pulled all of them right now. Shit. But it's it's kind of a gamble. You know, when all of them get the same aggro. The one mage crits every time and the other four or the or the other three do nothing. It's kind of dangerous. But I'm getting more and more confident with my play. So I guess in the future we do bigger and bigger and bigger pulls. I'm very, very high for Sulfur Rock man. Will be so good. But we have two more dungeons here. So killing humanoids all the time. But I think in Sulfur Rock it's humanoid as well, so whatever. They will run away too. I think my overall uh, play got better, very much better um, in comparison to the last video. So let's try not to pull the boss somewhere where I don't want him. Now the idea here is that the mages stand here in front of the door and I run in with my priest, get a, get a single mind blast off, that's why I click it in my bar so I don't cast anything else with my mages. And when the mind blast hit, hits, hits, I do a um, holy fire after that and I should have enough aggro that my mages can spam uh, fire uh, fireballs. And with these fireballs, they can wear them down, and I just dispel them when they get sheeped, and they never get the silence from the boss. That's pretty much the strat. Let's see if I can do it without fucking up again. Okay. I think I want them right here. It's good. 
Let's break the follow. Get a shield to me. He comes. Actually get it in their fire because he immediately hits me sometimes. You okay. will not defile these Base pull. Position him correctly. Do a mind blast. Come on. Oh, shit. And then just done my shit. Now he silenced me, which is not good because I'm low health. It's five seconds still. Do I have anything? I don't think I do. Okay, I'm lucky. At this particular moment, I'm very lucky because he goes to my other ones. Just for him. I get another of my blast off. And the I have aggro once again. Some motherfucker is not uh, the second. Run away, little girl. Run away. I don't think I'm in range. Come on, go, go, go. Fuck. That was bad. Okay, let's try this again. Let's go to my healer. I can't die right now with him. And spam as much as I can. Okay, I got the I got the heal through before I'm dying. Which is good. Let's get another holy fire. Just spam, 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 spam. Oh, that's a crit. Okay, that's good. And it's a hypnotic blade. Whoa. Uh, let's say it could have gone worse. It was the perfect thing what I did there. <laughs> I probably just jibbled a little bit. <laughs> because I tried to concentrate on, uh, yeah, not fucking up that bad again. Because I die a lot. On this char. Uh, on this boss. Sometimes he does very stupid stuff. And uh, he resists a lot. Uh, well, not that much anymore because now my level is okay. But just one dying. And I think I managed the aggro uh, with just one dying. And I think I managed the aggro okay ish. Now let's see. What do I do here for equipment? This one has the Rod of the Sleepwalker. But I saved um, this really, really good offhand with uh, 7 and 4 stem. This is 8 in 3 spirit and uh, 4 damage. I guess I do it like this and put the offhand on. That's good as well. Just a little bit different itemization. I want the, um, the staff though. This looks cool. And uh, I totally forgot to loot the key all the time. <laughs> so let's loot the key real quick. Perfect. And we got the key, we got everything. It was an okay run. It wasn't like the best of the best, but we still did kind of okay. And I will do this probably till level 36 or 37, maybe 38, I don't know. I have to try. It gives really good XP and I'm, get fa I'm getting faster and faster and faster. So I'm probably doing it for two or three more levels. And then we'll see ourselves again in the next one where we do the next Scarlet Monastery dungeon. Two more to go. And I think after that, we're going to two for Rock. So that's pretty cool. Uh, thank you very, very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this a little bit. And uh, yeah, the next one will be hopefully better with more macros and more uh, better play and bigger pulls. <laughs> so bye bye.